So, like I said, language is different from other types of communication because it's more complex. It has many symbols and many complex meanings. And also, it is not limited to a particular context, which means I can talk about anything, even if you've never seen it. And finally, because of how many symbols there are, language can be used to create an infinite number of meanings. We can create very long sentences that nobody has ever said before. Like, he knows that I think that she believes that he is lying about the time when he saw that she went um, to the grocery store and so on and so on and so on. This sentence could never end. So language is more complex. It is not limited to a particular context and it can create an infinite number of meanings. So in this course, we are going to talk about both linguistic and non-linguistic communication. Um, but we are going to focus on language. So first we're going to talk about animal communication to let us see how language is different and what is special about human language compared to animal language. And we'll see what differences made it possible, what things that are different in humans make language possible. Why don't animals speak? We'll talk about how language developed over time and over um, space, so in different places in the world. We'll talk about how people learn language, both as children, their first language, and their second language as adults. We'll talk about multilingualism and intercultural, intercultural communication, especially as it applies to the language situation in the UAE. And finally, we will also talk about written and electronic communication. So I look forward to seeing you in the next lecture. Thank you.